This Jackson Heights community in shock and disbelief after a nine year old boy is hit by a car and left to die by the driver. Witnesses like Ikra Shabazz tried to get help for the agonizing child. But he was twitching, he was breathing, he was totally fine. I mean, he looked like he was going to make it. I didn't realize that it was that bad. Police say the child Giovanni Ampuero was walking with his mother at the busy intersection of Northern Boulevard and 70th Street just after 1 o'clock Saturday afternoon. That's when police say 86-year-old Juan Jimenez made the fatal left turn and after striking the child in his red Jeep, kept going. I, I think she knew. I mean, I, I thought she was just freaking out, but I, she was saying he, he's not breathing and I, that's when I went up to him and I was like, I wanted to make sure he was breathing. Um, I think she knew. I think moms have that sixth sense. We're told witnesses chased down Jimenez, who was in his fleeing car. Then police arrested the elderly driver. That's really sad. That shouldn't have happened. People should at least take responsibility for their actions. Jimenez is charged with leaving the scene of an accident, failure to yield to a pedestrian, and failure to exercise due care. Little Giovanni lived just down the block from the scene of the hit and run. Those who only learned his name after the accident say they'll never forget it now. I'm very upset. Like, it could have been me. People in the area tell New York One they're especially worried about this intersection and busy roadway because there have been other accidents here in the past. In Jackson Heights, Queens, Amy Yancey, New York One.